And now, to Rebecca Doe, my beautiful wife. Her obvious qualities, it is her sense of adventure, fun and ambition that is infectious and will never cease to keep me on my toes. Whilst I know we have our dreams that we'll continue to strive for, I promise to never stop loving the everyday. It is the small things in life that you make so effortlessly enjoyable. You are my best friend, my partner in crime, and I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. We stand here to honour and celebrate the love shared between these two people as they come together to start their new life with a solemn vow surrounded by their closest family and friends. It seems only right that James and Rebecca enter the next stage of their lives together in the spectacular scenery we see today. Rebecca, I give you this ring. Rebecca, I give you this ring. As a symbol of our marriage. As a symbol of our marriage. And a token of my love and friendship. And a token of our love and friendship. <laughs> when two people pledge to love and care for each other in marriage, they create an identity unique to themselves, which binds them closer than any written or unspoken word. It therefore gives me great pleasure to now pronounce you husband and wife. So love, what is love? I genuinely not sure I have the answer, but I do know this. It may not be wrapped up in science. It may be difficult to capture in art. It may be hard to philosophize about, but when you see it, you know it's there. Everybody here today, every single one of us, is here because they love you. And what I would say is that we have all seen how much you love each other. We see it. You don't have to search far for love. It's here in front of our eyes right now. Unusually, fathers of the bride often say, can you give a toe to the bride and groom? I'm not going to do that. I'm just gonna ask you to raise a glass to love. <laughs> 